What a beautiful day it is today. What do we have here? Hey, hey! Hey, you! Yes, you. Do you know what is mathematics? Well, I bet you do. And you were going to say numbers, huh? Ha! Guess what? Math is not just mere numbers, you simpleton. It sounds like a dog toy. But actually, this is the sonorous war cry of a very angry frog. Now, now. Voice over man is really mean. And yes, mathematics does include number guys. And apparently, it's the heart of mathematics. Seems like you don't believe me? Well, I'll just grab someone to explain it then. Hi guys! So for today's vlog, I'll be showing you about what is mathematics. Sit back, relax, and I'll try to walk you through the magical world of mathematics. Stay tuned and you might find some guests who would help me explain. Seems exciting? Let's go! See these two? Aren't they the most essential numbers you ever find in any equation? You see back then, people didn't actually have a thing to symbolize the physical nothing in the presence of an existing object. People came up with numbers to symbolize the obvious things in life. According to Ian Stewart, mathematics uses symbol but it's no more those its symbols. The music is musical notation or language, a string from letters from an alphabet. This was literally how number concept came to be in human world. From here, how can we extend this number concept? I think my friend could redeem themselves for this one. <clears throat> now, if you'll excuse me, I should go for now. Bye. Hello, it's me again. Before anything else, I'm no simpleton, okay? I do know a thing or two about mathematics and its number concepts. See this? It's a fraction. Originally, you had eight slices, and for some natural reason, like your friend being hungry, somehow explained how much was taken, the result using numbers. How the human mind could come up with many real numbers to explain natural occurrences. This was how the real number concept was mostly introduced to society. And back then, people didn't really question its logic. So they invented these. The imaginary ones. Wow. So, I guess that's all. Math is right. We're done? Of course not. Come on. Math extends further into operations and functions. Basically, these two used to thingify. EFI? Perhaps somehow you just invented that word. Maybe that's not the point though. Operations and functions are numerical processes for us to understand how numbers could actually exist in real-time settings. Like mathematical proof? It's how mathematics becomes reinforced with logical foundation to prove the numbers existence hand in hand with operations and functions. Numbers create all sorts of possibilities by having longer solutions or shorter solutions that does not end with merely that. We need that. Oh, you need to all that grouping? Well, wow, that's incredible. Confusing? Frustrating? Well, well, now you have been exposed to what mathematicians deal with on a daily basis. Mathematics is not just mere numbers, but an entire fight to describe something that can be so painfully obvious to give proof about its existence. True, true. Incredibly frustrating indeed. <laughs>
Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell because, uh, you know, even though I'm a wizard, uh, I need to make a living. <laughs> but Pops, why do you need to make a living if you're entirely composed of mathematical sequence programmed inside a computer? NANI?! Silence, you mongrel. Well, that may be true, but at least I am undeniably more handsome than you. Okay. Well, that is all. Until next time. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.